Welcome to this tutorial. Today we're going to talk about the type 2 conditionals. Let's get started. Remember that conditionals are sentences with two clauses, a main clause and an if clause. Now conditionals state that the action in the main clause can only take place if a certain condition in the if clause is fulfilled. Have a look at the example over here. If we don't hurry, we will be late. Now this is a conditional sentence and it's used to state that the action in the main clause, being late, will take place if we don't hurry. Now there are five main types of conditionals in English and amongst them are conditional type 2 or second conditionals. Now, conditionals type 2 or second conditionals are used to describe hypothetical, unlikely, or even impossible situations. These sentences are not based on facts, thus we can refer to any time. Have a look at the example below. If Peter cleaned his place, he would let us come in. Now make sure to use the past simple tense in the if clause and would plus the base form of the verb in the main clause. Note that the order of the main and if clause is not fixed, although when the if clause precedes the main one, make sure to use a comma. Have a look at the table below. Now the if clause of the type 2 conditionals or the second conditionals is formed by using if plus past simple and the main clause would plus verb. Have a look at the examples below. If I won one million dollars, I would give it to charity. An event in the future that's unlikely to happen. If you found a formal black dress, it would look perfect on you. Unlikely to happen. Note that if we use the verb to be in the if clause, the form were is used even with the first and third person. Now we often use if I were you to express our opinion or to give advice. Have a look at the examples below. If I were a chef, I would work at some Italian restaurant. Expressing opinion. If I were you, I wouldn't take that job. Giving advice. Now compare the first conditional and the second conditional. Have a look at the examples below. If it snows today, we will definitely make a snowman. Now this sentence is in the first conditional because it is December right now and it's highly likely for it to snow. And in this sentence, if it's known today, we would be surprised. Now this is in the second conditional because it is May right now and it's almost impossible for it to snow.